Hey, what's up? I got a new base, so I'm gonna unbox it. Alright, here we go. Alright. So basically, pun intended. Um, yeah, we got a new base. DSP, LTD. Um, I, in my band, I play six string, and I love it, it's fun, but it's so heavy and really taxing on the shoulder and they're tuned they put my guitar players play seven strings and all that stretching my hand out for that long on the on the because you know it's six strings so it's got a flat fretboard so to reach that top string you really got it uh, it just gets fatiguing a little bit so i wanted to try four string I wanted to try five string, but then I saw this and thought, why not, you know? And I basically like to have the unboxing documented on video just in case like the headstock's broken or chip in the paint or something, you know, just for legal, legal reasons. Seems like it's packed really really well as usual I'll do a video on this later but you know I just wanted to do this really quick better lighting and all that stuff yeah. Yeah, cool. yeah. all the allen wrenches I need And they, they sent me pictures of it before. I really like this, this little dark wood right there. That's pretty cool. But this is like a, a more, I mean, I say more affordable in their line. I mean, it's still like 600 bucks, but I kind of want to use it as like a mod platform, basically. So I think eventually I'm going to get new stuff for it, maybe some new tuning keys I'm sure these are fine but I just want to kind of like do it up you know like new, some new pickups and maybe even like a new bridge and so here's it maybe some new knobs. I don't know I like the knobs but I like the black stuff out kind of make give everything as much black on it as possible Austin G Final Inspector and James S. Thank you, fellas. I appreciate you. 55 point inspection. Alright, so yeah, it's purple. It's, yeah, it's kind of got like a little, that little glitter, sparkly vibe going, which I didn't even really realize in the, in the picture. It's got it's a bolt-on neck, six six screw bolt-on neck. Small small dots. I don't know what, if this is showing up or not, but it's pretty badass, man. Hopefully, it'll. I'm not sure I'm gonna be putting it in A. So I might need to do some nut work on it. I'm not sure, but we'll get there. But yeah, it's just kind of a traditional style base. You yeah. know. It's not string through or anything. That's really pretty, man. Jeez. I don't know how well you can see it. This it's got a um I'm guessing these are the um, like the volume knobs, and then I'm guessing this is probably the EQ, like treble and bass. 
If there are ones on the bottom, and ones on the top. It's kind of like a stack. Which is different. That's weird. You know? Not weird, but it's, it's alright. Pretty much in tune, that's cool. No. Got a little bit of a bow in it. So yeah, it's just got stock pickups. I'm probably I've been looking at the Seymour Duncan quarter pounders maybe. I don't know, I'm gonna see what options are available, but yeah, this is it. When I see purple, I just have a hard time not saying no, you know. So this is my third base. So I need to get better. <laughs> base now. <laughs> no, but it's cool. Yeah. I just wanted to do this, make sure there wasn't any problems. I don't see anything wrong. Looks, looks killer, man. Yeah, it's slick. Alright, yep. ESP LTD AP 204. You'll be seeing more of it. Alright. Thanks for joining me. See you later.